Diamondbacks hosting the Padres. Patrick Corbin trying to become the first lefty in Diamondbacks history to start out 8-0. Bottom of the first, Padres up 1-0. Jason Marquis on the mound for the Friars. Eric Chavez, a two-run homer, his seventh of the year, second in as many games. D-backs on top at 2-1. In the second, Corbin looking sharp. He strikes out Jed Jerko swinging, and then he gets Marquis to end the inning. Bottom half of the second, a man on first. Miguel Montero skies one to left center. That's deep enough to score Martin Prado. Arizona on top, three to one. Top five, two outs. Carlos Quentin with a two-run homer, his fifth of the year. That tied the game up at four. Corbin's streak of nine starts with at least six innings while giving up two or fewer runs ends. Bottom of the fifth, Corbin batting now with a man on second and two outs, facing reliever Tommy Lane. Pollock goes, the pitch is lying down the left field line and drops in fair in front of Quentin. Coming home to score is Pollock. On his way for second is Corbin. He's going to be tagged out, but the run will score. KTAR with the call that made it a 5-4 game. Bottom of the seventh, one out and one on. Martin Prado steps in against Tim Stauffer. Prado will hit one to the gap in right center field. Over goes to North. He can't get it all the way to the wall. Kubel turns second, heads for third. Matt Williams got the go sign. Here we go, the play at the plate. He is safe. Double by Prado, his fourth hit of the day, and the Diamondbacks lead it 6-4. to four. Once again, KTAR with the call. It's 6-5 in the top of the eighth, two outs. Padres threatening, but Matt Reynolds gets the pinch hitter, Mark Kotze, to pop out to short to end the inning. Heath Bell throws a 1-2-3-9 for Arizona, and they hold on to win 6-5. Corbin stays perfect despite allowing a season-high three earned runs. He picks up his eighth win of the season, and the Diamondbacks are now 10-0 in games he started.